uh, in this uh, tutorial we will talk about some basic uh, properties uh, of uh, logarithms uh, so for example if we have log of x y so that will be equal to log of x plus log of y so let's uh, look into it again more carefully so if we say log of 100 so we know that log of 100 base 10 is equal to 2 now i can also write this as log of 10 10 multiplied by 10 so i can write 100 as 10 multiplied by 10 and in this case i can uh, if i use this uh, property then i will say log of 10 10 plus log of 10 10 and that will be equal to 1 and that plus 1 that will be equal to 2 so we get the same answer so if you don't even remember these properties then uh, you can uh, or you remember them uh, a little bit then you can always do this kind of test to look at these properties and see if it makes sense so the second uh, uh, example will be so if i have a uh, second property is that log of x raised to power y is equal to y log of x again let's take example of 100 so we have log of 100 uh, is equal to log of 10 raised to power 2 and that will equal to 2 we have log of 10 and that is equal to 2 so we get the same number using this uh, property so that's another property of logarithms now the third property is log of 1 over x is equal to negative log of x so if you look again if we have a log of 1 divided by 100 that is equal to log of uh, ten raised to the power minus 2 or equal to minus 2 and what is log of 100 log of 100 is equal to 2 so the difference between log of 1 by 100 and uh, 100 was or just of the negative sign so this is the third property of logarithms